So hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So hope you can hear me. So we're here at the final for the Island Conquest event of the year here at BGC Amphitheater. Actually, I was supposed to review something. I decided just to cover the event here. But then again, I still had a lot of fun of this. So let's go to the Everest Titanium and let's have a little review. So here now in the Ford Everest Titanium 4x4, I already did a full test day review exactly last year. So check it out on my channel. I've never ever done a walk around review. Well, still the same powering this 4x4 titanium is a 2 liter by turbocharged 4 cylinder engine with 210 horsepower and 500 and newton meters of torque. And this is the only one in the Everest lineup that has a 10 speed automatic transmission. And this as well is the only one equipped with adaptive cruise control. Everything here in the interior is exactly the same for your 12 inch infotainment system and the gear shift that automatically goes into park if in case you uh, forget to put it back to park or when you just turn, simply turn the engine off. I kind of miss the what ergonomics of Ford here, especially here with the double glove box. It did not show you before besides the uh, panoramic moonroof is the third row. I did not expect this at all. I literally forgot all about it that you can electronically fold up and down the third row itself which is pretty amazing so i'll be just here in this everest titanium because it's so loud here what else i've done here in the event i just test drove the ranger raptor i just as well did a full test day review of that i just wanted to have a little bit more fun and as well there are a lot of freebies given here by uh, ford philippines so i got stickers already stuck again in my water jug and i did to a uh, right on the ford territory right over there that white one that's the first time i've ever ever written in a car and i had to write that for obvious reasons and as well check out my instagram and shout out to all the people who were able to write on the Ford territory. Remember, this is the first day of the event, which will last until probably tomorrow on Sunday. Well, by the time this already has been uploaded. And two, I did a photo boot session, which I to thank as well to Ford Philippines. And hopefully, I can have a full land out soon on my channel. And I'll probably just pick what car. And I would guarantee every Ford that I've driven now, well, they're actually all here in display. It's one of the best ones in their classes. So, Hope you guys like and subscribe and I will see you hopefully in next year's Ford Island Conquest event. Bye-bye